Yo right, guys and girls, welcome back. It is 2.26 in the morning, Thursday the 21st of June. And downstairs at the moment, making a nice hot chocolate for me and my mum. At this time in the morning. And yeah, I just wanted to show because I want to do this video actually. Because I wanted, it was going to do, I've got three, technically three. Actually, I might just do them for this one video. But the first one I'm going to show... Um, so I went to an antique shop yesterday because I'm trying to get some like all uh, these old sort of antiques um, pottery stuff like ones where you got people's faces on it anyway I found this beautiful little thing here this was pretty cool you can actually see the lips the actual um, lips itself looks pretty cool it don't look like there's anything wrong with it this is actually Admiral Lord St. Vincent by Gerald Ebbleton or Embleton The Franklin Porcelain Studio Malaysia 1984 MT by the Mar Murray Time Trust presents and yeah I think this is uh, one of those like Dalton um, porcelain Toby jugs. It actually it is a Toby jug, but it's a massive one. Now I believe Lord St. Vincent was to do with the Napoleonic War. I believe he was uh, something to do with that Lord Nelson uh, when they were having at the Battle of Trafalgar Square and all that kind of stuff. So that looks quite cool. I do like this and it's actually, if I show you the bottom print bit, it's actually pretty cool. I think this is an authentic one as well. So, um, needs a bit of a wash out though at the bottom because it looks a bit messy down there. Messy, messy. But yeah, I'm going to try and collect some of these because these apparently, with the handle as well, it comes with the handle. Well, actually, the handle was actually glued on by the looks of it. So that's pretty, actually, cool. Like, the sort of glued, not glued on, but sort of clay because this is actually a clay ornament and I'll be right back in a second guys and girls right guys and girls right I'm back so I've got another one two here so I've got this one this one is Admiral Lord Hood like a bit like Robin Hood but it's Hood so it's Lord Admiral Admiral Lord Hood presents by Gerald Ebbleton again as well or Embleton it's E M B L E T O N. So that's actually right there. And this is Married Time Trust Presents still. And this is actually pretty cool. It, I don't know what it is. It's like sort of um, sort of a pipe or maybe a cane stick. But they've actually it's really good. It's like a handle. It's like a, well it is a handle because it's on there. I don't actually know what these were made for. If it's just an actually just like sort of a milk jug or something. They call them Toby jugs so I guess like sort of milk jugs or some sort. But yeah, pretty cool. I actually love it. It looks so authentic. The peakiness of the colour on the face there it looks really good. I want to try and get one next of Napoleon. Um... I think he was the general and stuff back in the French Revolution and, and all that. And then America. I want to try and get some American Revolution uh, stuff as well. But yeah, this is pretty cool. You can see a little hat as well um, to do with the ship. So he must have been like Captain or Ad oh, it says here Admiral. So I suppose that means the guy in charge or of the ship at the time. Now this has got to be around about, I would say, 17th coming towards 18th century by the looks of it um, of the character um, of the real battles and stuff so the, uh, the one I checked up uh, which I got in the other room which I just showed at the start uh, apparently he was a politician or something so that's pretty cool having a politician one now here's another one this looks quite cool um, actually that needs a bit of a clean out as well a bit dirty in there I don't know if you guys and girls can guess who this is, but this looks quite cool. This looks like a beer sort of jug, like you would have back in the old days, 
sort of just jugging it down and all that back in 17th or something. Uh, this one is Sir Richard Granville, whoever he is. I actually have no idea. I'm going to have to do some checking up on him. I just got these because I had a good sense that these would be worth something for what I paid for them. Um, but yeah, I got these in town yesterday. They look flipping awesome. This looks incredible, especially his white stripey sort of beard where it's going all downwards. Looks like authentic, realistic sort of beard. And my God, look at his lips as well. You can see the lip color in. You can see the peakiness of um, the actual color of the face. Looks really, it looks quite lifelike actually. You can see his like little eyebrows there as well that he's got. On this one, he's got like an eyebrow, but this one seems to be almost covered up by his hat, uh, as almost. And you can see his ear there on the back. This looks quite cool. And then he's got, oh my God, he's got a little ponytail. Yeah, a little ponytail there, all sort of on the head. And then that connects, that connects up to the handle here. So that's pretty cool. So it goes all the way around here, all the way up to the handle bit. And then he's got his little sort of, looks like, um, yeah, like a little sort of coat he's wearing as well. Look. That's pretty cool. And this one is there as well on the back. But yeah, I'm definitely going to be looking into these because I'm going to try and collect loads of these uh, for the price. Uh, pretty cool. I'd say if you're collecting them, just look around for porcelain because I would guess porcelain is quite expensive anyway. Especially for these sort of type things. Anyway guys and girls, I'm going to get off for a bit. Just do my hot chocolate for my mum and me. And I'll see you on the next video guys and girls. Cheers for watching. Stay safe all.